Hello there guys, what is up? And welcome back to another video here on Nash Vlogs. Today is another theme park update, but this time it's from Legoland Windsor. We had an, an announcement from Legoland Windsor that when they reopen there will be a few rides shut to help with social distancing. Now the list of rides that are going to be shut, some of them are surprising, some of them aren't. Let's go through the first part of the list. So the rides that will be currently closed are as follows. So the first one they've announced is Haunted House Monster Party. Now, they've announced that this ride, which is a Vacoma Madhouse, will not be reopening until 2021. So it's going to be spending pretty much the whole season shut. Apart, I think it was open during um, Fair Half Term and at the start of the season. But it's going to remain shut for the rest of the year. This is surprising, I'm not going to lie. Uh, I personally enjoy it. It's quite a fun attraction. And it's a shame as it's one of the reasons I go. So, um, yeah. Shame it's not going to be reopening. Uh, the next one, the next couple of rides that are also going to be shut. For the time being, now these rides have not been confirmed to be closed for the whole year, but they're going to be closed for the time being. And these are Laser Raiders, Scarab Bouncers, Sky Rider, Lego City Deep Sea Adventure, Model Making Studio, Lego Game Zone, Lego Reef Apocalypseburg, and Pirate Goldfish will be closed for the time being. Um, Laser Raiders, if you've seen my last vlog from um, from Legoland back in 2018 when me, Life of Dills and um, Theme Park Extreme and Daniel, you will know that I'm not a huge fan of Laser Raiders. I think it's crap. Now two more rides have also been confirmed to be returning next year, so we'll be closed for the rest of the year. And that is Squid Surfer and Dragon's Apprentice. Now, Dragon's Apprentice I haven't done, so I can't really have much of an opinion, but it's uh, the family version of the Dragon Coaster. And Squid Surfers. Now, this I'm I'm slightly sad about because I, I, I quite enjoy Squid Surfers. I'm not going to lie. Whenever I go with people, we always have loads of fun on Squid Surfers because it's insane. But, obviously, if you go on uh, the uh, Legoland Windsor website and you look on a bit of the page which says ride availability uh, there are obviously a couple of other things that are going to be shut uh, but which were shut just before the pandemic started which I think may or may remain shut uh, for the rest of the year so the first one being um, Lego Reef that can't be closed till further notice Lego Studios 4D which is their 4D cinema that's going to be closed obviously uh, recently, Poles Park announced that their 4D cinema will be closed for the rest of the year. Um, if anything, now that we know that Poles Park and Legoland Windsor's 4D cinema are going to be closed, I'm hoping that Fort Park are going to follow suit with um, Angry Birds 4D. And also, uh, the Pirates of Skeleton Bay stunt show was also announced, uh, which closed just before the pandemic. I'm going to be honest. I think the Pirates of Skeleton Bay show is going to come back, but there's not going to be any like meet and greet segment after the show, and I think there's going to be a lot of social distancing on that harbour. And I will not be surprised if there's certain effects turn off, to be honest with you. But yeah, anyway, that's the end of this video. I'd like to hear your thoughts below. Um, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.